Good morning. It is Thursday, week 10. Yeah, this morning. Look what I got. Sonarworks reference for Sonarworks microphone so I can properly treat my studio. And yeah, I don't know if you can tell, but my studio is a literal complete square, which is horrible for acoustics. They say if that is the room you're working with to put your desk in the middle of the room, it just isn't gonna work here. We're gonna use this, see if it makes a difference. Apparently using this microphone is hit or miss. I've heard it's time consuming because you literally have to hold it against the microphone like for 30 plus different points. I'm hoping that we don't have any issues like that and we're able to set it up pretty easily. This morning though, breakfast, then editing the vlog, getting that posted, let's go. So from my understanding, basically what this is, is this mic is gonna measure my speakers in my room and the phasing and the distance between my speakers and the listener position. Uh, I kind of analyze how the sound bounces around the room and give me a flat response curve, a flat EQ. And what this is gonna enable me to do is basically mix with perfectly balanced speakers, almost mimicking a high-end professional level studio. So this is their high-end microphone, which I'm going to be using to measure my speakers with from a variety of different spots that the software is going to guide me through. Stay where you are. Measurements in progress. Stay where you are. Measurements in progress. All right, here's the crazy part. 37 different locations and I have to hold the mic exactly in the right spot every time. Here we go. That took a long time. <laughs> All right, we're back from our walk and we are jumping straight in to unit 10 and a nice healthy snack. Keep crushing it this week, everybody. Let's go. Absolutely epic day in the studio today. Installed our sonar works, finished all the lessons for unit 10, just posted another vlog. You know what to do. Go take a listen. Which which one does it come up? We are gonna take off from the studio and tomorrow the last assignment for unit 10, which is all about automation. We are on that this morning, right over here in Ableton, and the freaking internet's down in the studio. So yeah, there's that. But uh yeah, we're, we just pulled up the criteria on our phone and I mean, we're working away in Ableton and I don't need an internet connection for that. Happy freaking Friday, everybody. Actually, you know what? Not happy Friday. I like freaking every day of the week. I don't live for the weekend. You know what I mean? I'm here 
trying to set these goals and smash them, and I hope you are too. All right, let's jump back into Ableton and get to work. You know what I've noticed? It is pretty easy to talk myself, or at least try to talk myself out of going for my 2 p.m. walk. Almost tried it today, but uh, yeah, we, we were doing this thing with Art of Flow class that is talking about basically being conscious of our thoughts. And so I became conscious and aware that I was trying to talk myself out of it. So I just got up and went. And guess what? I'm not even kidding you. The second I walked out the door and I saw the nice blue sky and that's the nice bright sun out there beaming in the window, I instantly felt better. So that kind of tells me everything I need to know. So if you're starting your ritual, I know we've had at least one person comment about their ritual and what they're committing to do, uh, which is really cool. But yeah, uh, keep it up going into 2021. It's only going to benefit you. Yeah, next week is our last week before Christmas holidays at Icon, which I mean, it'll be holidays for Icon, but I'm going to be taking that two weeks to work on music and spend some quality Christmas time with Becca and our little guy Oliver who's doing quite well um, they're just running a few tests on him still but uh, he's he's totally back to normal yeah so we got about 30 minutes into yoga probably just gonna continue to work on our automation assignment what am I gonna say let's go <laughs> all right so look at these cool plugins behind me um, I just got them they're from mastering the mix yeah I'm super super impressed with them right now I've just been looking at some tutorials um, using one of my tracks as kind of a guinea pig for learning and it's enhancing them like I've never seen before just started editing our very first Christmas portion of the vlog. Yeah, these really, really amazing freaking beat sensitive lights that if you didn't see the last vlog, go and check that out right now. These lights are insane. Yeah, I, I really like Christmas time. Um, I used to spend it with my grandmother uh, at my aunt's and I sort of thought when she passed away, it would kind of lose most of its meaning. But, you know, I, I was kind of able to, to make the best of it and actually cherish those times and, and, and not get not get down on myself because they were over. So yeah, I'm able to make new traditions and do new things and, and still really enjoy quality time and doing Christmas activities. But yeah, tomorrow I will finalize my last Unit 10 assignment. We are just going through and making sure that we have everything from the rubric and the assignment that is required. We are feeling freaking fantastic today. I hope you had a good week. I hope your weekend's going well. And you know what? We're gonna finalize this, we're gonna get it in and then uh, make a little tea for ourselves. Have a little relax. Give yourself a pat on the back. And if you can't do it from yourself, then do it from me. All right, full on Christmas vibes in the studio. We are just taking a crack at mastering and I'm feeling pretty good about it. I'm really loving my new plugins and uh, things are sounding pretty clean. I don't think my assignment got marked. So for the third week in a row, looks like we're gonna have a Sunday fun day on a Monday, but that's okay. All right, let's dive back into this. Well, okay, I was wrong. Looks like we got some video feedback on our automation assignment. Let's check it out together for the first time. All right, nice, pretty cool track. Keep up the good work and uh, yeah, I'll see you on the next one, bye-bye. So he liked the track and a hundred percent. Yes. All right. Carrying on with this fun little mastering job.
love it. We're all Christmassy in here in the studio. I don't know what it is like. I don't know if it's just perspective on a difficult year and a time of year to just reflect on things, you know, what I've done, what I've accomplished. Yeah, some some big things in life this year. So I'm, I'm just feeling kind of reflective and grateful that this year has gone this way because I truly understand um, that this has been the most difficult year for a lot of people. I personally know people whose family members have died from COVID. It's a time of year for me to reflect, to have gratitude, and to just keep going. All right, that is it for me in the studio. The track that I finalized is sounding pretty good. I'm gonna give it a couple days, go back, listen to some other similar tracks that are made by top, top, top producers just to compare. Um, feeling pretty good about how it's sounding though. Uh, so yeah, obviously that last assignment did get marked. So we will continue on with Sunday Fun Day and uh, yeah, regular scheduled programming. Yeah, we want McDonald's for dinner. So we're gonna do that. Chicken nugget life. Anyways, yeah, we're gonna watch Christmas movie, eat our McDonald's and chill out.